This is Brandon Lee with BetFirms.com here with your 2012 Buffalo Bills football predictions. The Buffalo Bills got off to a 5-2 start last season, which included a 34-31 home victory over AFC East rival New England. They were the talk of the league through the first half, but would go on to lose 7 straight in 8 of their final 9 games overall for a 6-10 finish. The Bills have improved their team mainly through the draft over the past few years. They have an excellent chance to start showing improvement and to put an end to the NFL's longest playoff drought. Buffalo has not been to the postseason since 1999. The offense improved quite a bit last season, averaging 23.3 points and 352 total yards per game. Surprisingly, their best players on this side of the ball were 7th round picks Ryan Fitzpatrick and Stevie Johnson and undrafted free agent Fred Jackson. Fitzpatrick is coming off his best season yet. The Harvard grad completed 62% of his passes for 3,832 yards with 24 touchdowns and 23 interceptions. He was a legitimate MVP candidate in the first half of the season, but after getting paid, he slumped the rest of the way. Look for Fitzpatrick to come back focused and determined in 2012. Jackson is probably the most underrated running back in the entire league. He rushed for 934 yards to go along with 442 receiving yards and 6 total touchdowns. Jackson accounted for 24.5% of the team's offense last year despite missing 6 games due to injury. Former first round pick C.J. Spiller played well in his place and continues to improve. The receiving corps returns intact. Leading the way is Johnson, who is quietly becoming one of the top receivers in the league. Wideout David Nelson and tight end Scott Chandler came out of nowhere last year to have surprisingly productive seasons. The offensive line played very well last season. It allowed the fewest sacks, hits, and hurries ever by a Buffalo O-line. The interior is very solid with the return of left guard Andy Levitri, center Eric Wood, and right guard Craig Urbick. Right tackle Eric Pierce also played pretty well, allowing just three and a half sacks. The left tackle position will be a battle between rookie second rounder Cordy Glenn and 2011 fourth rounder Chris Hairston. The defense was one of the worst in the league last year, surrendering 27.7 points and 371 total yards per game. Buffalo was forced to try and win shootouts week after week due to poor play on this side of the ball. The Bills have addressed some need through the draft and free agency, and as a result, they should be improved on defense in 2012. Their biggest signing was former Texans defensive end Mario Williams, who has 13 and a half sacks over the past two years despite missing nearly half of his games due to injury. They also added in defensive end Mark Anderson from New England, and this duo will wreak havoc on opposing quarterbacks all season. Defensive tackle Kyle Williams returns from a foot injury that kept him out almost all of last year. 2011 first-round defensive tackle Marcel Darius had a productive rookie campaign and should be even better in his second year. Injuries really hurt the linebacker corps once again last season as three linebackers were placed on RIR. Weak side linebacker Nick Barnett was an excellent addition last season and led the team in tackles. Middle linebacker Kelvin Shepard proved to be a solid pick in the third round and played about as well as you could expect for a rookie. Strong side linebacker Kirk Morrison dealt with a hamstring injury and was put on the IR midseason, but he returns healthy and will start alongside Barnett and Shepard. Buffalo is very young in the secondary, but they've added some talent here through the draft in recent years. Rookie corner Stephen Gilmore was a first-round pick and will likely start opposite 2011 second-round corner Aaron Williams. Free safety Jarius Bird and strong safety George Wilson combined to form one of the most underrated safety tandems in the NFL. The secondary should benefit from improved pass rush in 2012. Now for my AFC East prediction. I have Buffalo picked to finish third in the division with an 8-8 eight eight overall record. Many believe that 2012 is the year the Bills break through and get to the playoffs for the first time since 99. I love the additions of Williams and Anderson at defensive end, which will give Buffalo one of the best defensive lines in the league. I still have some concern about the offense considering they lack playmakers at the receiver positions and failed to upgrade here. They also draw both San Francisco and Houston on the road while both the Patriots and Jets get those two teams at home. Buffalo is close, but I'm expecting it to finish 500 this season and still be at least another year away from playoff contention.